Welcome back everyone Groucher here and today we are playing some more new cycle, how are we doing? Alright so it's saying that we've got a group of travellers at our settlement, they're on their way in and we are kind of paused so everything's going so slow. But what I think I've realised on the, uh, the oh, what are they called, on the conveyor belts and stuff about Bunker Sector 3 has been built. So what we forgot to do was we need to upgrade some of these so that we can run some conveyor systems out of them. So I couldn't figure out why we were feeding stuff into this and the reason was we need to feed it from these into that. So we're going to have to upgrade all of these and start working on things that way. So let's do them ones. Our graphics are kind of looking a bit weird, aren't they? Is it just me? Oh, it's because we're fading out. <laughs> Never mind, ignore me. Right, we'll upgrade you. Upgrade you. And upgrade you. Right, so we've got a group of travellers. I'm going to let these ones in, because I think we're still doing okay for most of our stuff. And that's another 49 people. What? That is an insane number of people. We have got 779 of them people now. Our kitchens are looking a little bit worse for wear here. Let's see if we can get these back up and running. I'm not too sure why they weren't working, but they will be in a sec. Right, so they're done. This must have been from when we had no power. And everything's just gone offline, and things are looking really dodgy. Right, so that looks like they're all back up and running again now. Which is good, because we need the food. <laughs> we do, don't we? Right, so they are being upgraded. That's still in... What's that saying? Conveyor belt settings. Okay, okay, okay. So, what's this? Hereditary hazards from the community. Chief, although we understand that the bunker has established rules that govern its residents in a fair and humane manner, there is one issue we must take very, very, very seriously. Unfortunately, some of us carry diseases inherited from our ancestors, and we cannot risk harbouring hereditary diseases while trying to save our species with a handful of people. We need to come up with strict rules. Please consider carefully. This could determine the future of our species. We have to allow this reality to drown our conscience. That would be too drastic. We need a reasonable middle ground. We come this far, I believe we will persevere somehow. I think we need a middle ground. Anyone who doesn't have contagious or obvious diseases can be chosen. Yep. So, it's on them to not get sick, isn't it? <laughs> Just having a little double check of the settings, because it kind of looks weird when we're in some of our menus, didn't it? Like, when we click on these, it must just be... I don't actually know, but everything goes kind of weird. Maybe it's never happened before, I don't know. We can upgrade some of these. Right, let's have a look at our belts. Let's have a look at our conveyor belts and see if we can sort this out this time. So, we have got... This one is upgraded. Did we finish upgrading this one yet? We didn't. So we need to do that. Oh, we need steel. Okay, well, let's just get... Our belt. One input and three output points. So we need a belt merger. Three input points and one output point. So I think that's what we need first, is it? Let's get one of them and we're gonna want to do that like that no because that's a blue one so we need the other one we need the three blue and one orange so if we stick this there we're gonna get a conveyor belt from from you Right, we might need to tab this out from that one. That I messed up. Is that not going into this? It's going into the end one. I don't want it to. I want it to go into the front one. Right, can we raise and lower this, or does it not matter? Oh, this snapping is horrible. Right, so that goes into there anyway. I think that doesn't look right, does it? <laughs> right, let's delete you. So that stuff's coming down, and it's just going to the floor. So we need to... Right, I'm sure there was a way to... Oh, sugar. Stop it. Demolish. Demolish. Right, is there a way? Right, so that looks like... Ah, uh, I think I've done the wrong one here. Or have I? I don't want to spend another... See, that one comes to there. 
Oh, hang on. Scroll, shift and scroll to adjust height. So if we do that. goes wonky doesn't it so if we do this to here and do that one to might need to go a little bit higher again I think this has got to go into the orange side it does okay yeah so we need to delete this one and we need to do the next one not that one, this one. So, rotate you. Get one of these. So fiddly. Does that look like it goes to the right place? That looks okay, doesn't it? Kind of goes down and up. And then we need to feed this into... What's this one? This is copper. So, oops. So, we need the one that's doing copper. Or oh, that's got to go into this one. But I don't think that's what we want to do, actually. I think what we want to do is we want to have a belt separator. So, we want to... Do like this. And then we're going to want one of these conveyor belts coming from you. it there and then this one from there to there okay so hopefully this is where so we need to do one more going from this one and then this one it turns blue but it's not Ah, there we go. Right, I'm thinking... That should be correct. But it's not moving. Right, conveyor belt settings. Output. Materials on belt. So it is moving towards it. It's just not... It's stopping when it gets to here. So let's see if we can get another one of these coming this way. One there. And another one of these coming from you to... From you to you. This is stuff in the way for this one. Right, we might have to come around this side a little bit. to there like that so why is the best belt separator not doing anything let's see did we manage to get enough stuff we'll upgrade that one don't know whether we managed to upgrade this one either we didn't but we haven't got enough steel for that one either but once this one is done looks like we still haven't got enough we need loads more steel but that kind of looks like how it's supposed to go it's just stopped And do we need to choose the material? Conveyor belt, no items on belt. This one has got copper on the belt. So that's using electricity, so I'll put socket. Right, click here to set the material that can pass through socket 2. So we want socket 2 to be copper. Here we go, we figured it out. So that should improve this loads. That's doing 28 a day. Let's see if that goes up more. Well, the efficiency has gone up to 131. Let's see what it is on this one. Efficiency is on 41, so that is improving it a, rare, a lot, a hell of a lot. Right, so next we need this one upgraded. But we need loads of steel first. We're not really producing enough steel to get that going. End of year 33, we're probably nearly in year 34 by the time we look at this one. 14 people died, 
40 new people joined us, our population increased by 45%, our stuff replenished by 89%, and we made loads of food and water, so that's not really an issue. So we need to figure out what's making the steel, because I can't remember. It's going to be like a kiln, is it? No. Metalworks? Oh, where did we put our metalworks? There. Right, that's making steel, it's only making 12 a day. Now, can we, we can't upgrade the metalworks, so I don't think we can do anything with them. Something's just popped up. Merchants has arrived. Have you got anything for us? Iron and stuff. No, we'll... Oh, later. Okay, so it's just stealing. We need to figure out... We need another... Let's check on our little metalworks again. So this one's doing steel, which is fine. We're getting clay, coal, and iron ingots. We're going to need another metalworks. So let's stick one up there. So production, probably a number two, a metalworks. We'll stick you right there. We put, have to put you back on this, don't we? There we go. So we get a metal wax put there. We've got another group of people coming in. How many is this? Another 27. Right, that takes us over 800. So I think I think we might have to stop a little bit. <laughs> That's we've had like we've had so many people come in this week. So our metal wax is being built. If we can get more steel coming, that should be okay. Right, how we do? We got five of them and five of them. We could probably do a training some more people and our paper. We got loads of paper, so that isn't too bad. Now we can do five of you. How are we doing for tools these days? Can't even see them. We got two thousand tools, so we got loads. So we do five craftsmen in that one, and we'll try and do five more specialists in this one. Our metalworks is built. We're gonna do steel. We're gonna get eight of you in there. And we haven't got any unoccupied workers. Alright, well, we're just waiting for our training to go through then. And then we'll see if we can populate that. So, things are coming together. We've still only got two steel. Our steel's going really quick. So, right, we've got two more, which is okay. That gives us the two people we need for this one. But we're going to train another bunch. I'd like to get a nice little surplus of these because we've got the people, we've got 180 people sitting here doing nothing. Training complete. Oh, we got all five of them. So now we've got no more of these guys. Let's see if we can do two lots of them. Let's see if we can get close to 20 people. I don't know whether we've got any more vocational trainers. Oh, we got another one there. Let's see if we can do another five. Right, things are looking good. We are in winter. Training is complete. We did get five of them that time. That's perfect. So we could end up with 15 of these, and that would be really good. Right, we had our next phase of this was done, wasn't it? Layer three is done. Right, training complete. Oh, it moved us all the way back. Right, back over here. Back over there. Right, so layer three is done. So what do we want to put into this? Empty slot. Logistics. We haven't really got enough stuff to make most of these things already, I don't think. Right, we could do an indoor farm. That would give us... 35 food, which is actually quite good. So let's do one of them. So our first layer is more or less done. Let's see what we can put in the last piece. So water, we haven't got enough stuff. We could do another farm on that level, but that's all we can do. So we're just going to have to wait. Can we start? Oh, we need 285 steel and we can start building sector four. But there's five sectors, so we can fit a lot of people into this bunker, you know. We got another five, so we got 12 of them people up and running. So let's see. Do our steel start building up? Will our steel start building up? So we're making 11 a day in this one, which is kind of rubbish. In this one. We're making 10 a day. So that... Oh, we can fit an extra person in there. So there's 22 a day we're making now. But we still only got four. So we need to build this up a little bit. And we can carry on with the conveyor belts. Year 34 is over. Right, where were we doing our mine before? So we have already got them set up. But what we need to set up next will be the one from this one. And I don't know whether we're going to be able to get one from here to here. It's going to be kind of awkward. End of year 34, 27 people joined us, 35 population increase. 
Our stuff didn't replenish a lot this year. The fish and meat and mushrooms and stuff. Our annual water went up by 18,000. That's massive. And our food is still doing okay. So, yeah. I'm happy with the way things are going. Hey, we can probably do stuff with this with the conveyor belt as well, I guess. Petrol from that to that, maybe. I don't know. But we're doing really well for our power anyway. This is our quarry. This is getting clay. Which could probably go into one of these as well. But I don't think we've got enough room to do that anyway. We just have to leave that as it is. Right, so our steel. We're still struggling. We're still struggling. We might need an extra metalworks. That's making 50 in a day now. So that's doing alright. We have got... 5,000 iron ingots. 21,000 coal. And 10,000 clay. So let's do... One more metalworks, and we'll just stick you in that gap there. When that's built, I should be... It's going to be like 30, nearly 40 a day. So surely we can't be going through that many. But our power's looking okay. Our cement, we could do with adding to our storage some cement. I see cement. I'm going to raise that to 10,000. Clay, we've got 10k. Alcohol, we're going to raise that to 5,000. Bricks are okay. Copper, crude oil, we probably want a bit more of this. Diesel, same again. We might need some more storage soon because we're going to fill up quite quick. Everything else is looking okay though. Motors, we probably want a few of them. Paper is good. Simple meals are fine. Tin ingots are good. Tin ore. Right, we're going to raise our workwear. We could probably do it under the tailor looking at that because our workwear is pretty bad. So production. Uh, where's our tailor? There. Tailor. Can we fit you in any of these gaps? Hey, we can do you there. Is that one the tailor? Yeah, we'll have two tailors back to back and we can start making more than eight a day. We've got a few people a little bit unwell, so let's see if we can give them some impatient rest leave. Do we have enough stuff now to do our other one, the end of year celebrations? No, we're, we're short on beer. It needs 91. Click to activate. Oh, that's not what it means. <laughs> Ignore me. Alright, so our next metalworks is done. We're going to do metal again. Get eight of you in there. Get two of you in there. We have still got ten people left over, and that is good. Oh, power's just gone. Why? That's making 9,000 power. We've got loads. Of, we could probably do with another diesel plant, you know. So, production. What's it under? Utilities. A diesel plant. That won't fit there. We could put it on this side. Right, all our stuff is low on power, which is really, really bad. But that's making 9,000. Oh, it's making 20,000 power. Must be our coal power plant then. I don't remember where we put that one. Oh, these. Coal generators. See, they're making loads. We're just not keeping up right now. But hopefully when this is built, we'll be fine. That's going to use a little bit more of our steel, maybe. No, it's not. It's got a minus one on the steel there. Oh, yeah, we need 200 not steel. And we're not producing the steel because we've got no power. <laughs> the way it works, eh? Merchants and travellers have appeared. I think we're going to have to say no to these travellers. I'm sorry, but we haven't got enough room for you. And even if we do get you in, we're not going to fit you in the bunker anyway. So, that's just tough. Just hope they don't get angry. So, things are looking well. Things are looking well. So, we only need steel for this one, but we still don't have enough. We've got none at all. But maybe once this is done, we'll be good. But it's going to take us a little while. But we're minus 20,000 now. How are we doing for diesel? Do we need... We've got 2,300, so we're doing okay for that. Group of travellers, we're going to reject you, I'm sorry. Don't know where you're going to go and live, but it's not here. Merchants has arrived. Start trade. Nothing. The merchants are a bit rubbish, aren't they? 
So we've got our greenhouses. I thought we would have been able to make like mushrooms and stuff in the greenhouses. Let's see if there's anything else we can learn. All the way to the end, underground insulation. Using the right materials and the right surfaces will reduce the lossage and leakage rate of underground components. Water pump and oil pump efficiency. 20 plus. Right, we're short on steel for that, we can't do this. Industrial forge. We need steel for that one. We need steel for that. We need belt integrated steel furnaces for that one. And we need steel for that one. So we can't do any of the last ones until we start building up our steel. But we are back in the red, in the green on the power. And this shouldn't take long now. We've got 88, so we need another 200 ish to finish that off. And our bunker, how is this coming along? So, sector one is nearly full. We haven't done anything on sector two, but sector three has got food. Sector four, we still need 285 steel before we can start building it. It's going to take us a while, isn't it? Some time, anyway. So, this is going in at a decent speed. Decent speed, nothing, nothing major. But we should be making six all the time now. Yeah, look at that. We're nearly halfway. But I want to thank everyone who keeps coming in. I know this series is getting a bit longer now. And I want to thank you all for coming in and watching. It really does mean a lot. If you are enjoying the series and you do want to see more, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed the episodes, hit the thumbs up. Drop some comments down below. It helps the videos getting pushed out really massively. Okay, we've got our tailor done. Let's get some more work where we're going to get four of you in there. One of you in there. And that should sort it out a little bit. We've got 24 sick people, so maybe we should have told them others they can come in. Right, we are in autumn. Water pump has exhausted its supply. we still got nearly 47,000 water, so that's quite good. And this is coming along now. We've got 250 out of 285. And then, once that's done, we're going to get this upgraded. And then we're going to do some stuff in there. Try and get this belt going. See if we can produce stuff quicker. Well, it's got to be nearly done. There we go. It's just waiting for construction now. So we should start building this up fairly quick. There we go. Went up to six. Two. It's gone down again. <laughs> it's rubbish, isn't it? Well, we shouldn't have any power issues anyway after this is built because we should keep producing quite a few. But everything is going to plan for now. For now. No, we haven't had any mass deaths. Do you remember when... I don't know if you watched when we played like the early access before it was released and we were on like the beta alpha whatever the version was the alpha version uh the deaths were horrendous you were just um out of nowhere nearly your whole population would just die <laughs> look at the way that's being built in the snow they've done the foundations or oh, they're doing more of the foundations i want to see how this comes together because i do like the graphics and how this game looks and works and things so things are going they're all hammering away and they don't seem to be getting anywhere Metalwork staff died and she was replaced by Holly Parker. Well, that went up quick. That went up really quick. So, do we need to populate this? We do. So, we're going to need some... Oh, we've got no specialists left. Let's go and sort that out. We need... Where are they? Oh, my God. It's hard to tell in the snow. We're going to see if we can do five of you. And we'll do five of you. Should have looked at this, at this before we even started, shouldn't we? But that is up and running. We're going to select power. We're going to get six of you, two of you, and we're not producing anything just yet. Someone is dead in there. We need another specialist for this too. We've just had some people born or something because our six kids became adults. So we're just waiting on the training. Right, end of year 35, 16 people died. So our population was minus 14, which isn't too bad. I mean, it's not great, but it's not bad. 74% on stuff replenishing. Our rations went down a little bit, but our kitchens were a bit goose twenty. Right, we've got five of you. Let's see, we're going to need more. Because we are going through these specialists, something stupid. Right, hopefully we get at least three specialists from this little thing, because we need one in there. Oh, lovely, we got five. But we're going to go for five more, just to try and get some backups in case... Stuff goes wrong again. Right, so our quarry's working. Our specialists are done. We're just two people short, two workers short on that. And our steel is up to 30. Right, how many do we need to upgrade this? 50. So we're on. We're getting there. We're getting there. 
Training is complete. We got another five of you, which is good because we need to put. Uh, which one was it? We need to put two of them in there. And then we could do with trying to get five more. Right, we've got a sandstorm. 101 people, 101 people are sick, and the reason is access to medication, which is not great. Right, we've got five specialists. Spare no. Access to medication. Where are we doing our medicines? Infirmary. Right, we're short on. We're short on apples and medicine. So where do we make our medicine? It's been ages, you know, and I just can't remember. Cannot remember. Not the kilns. We got our little watchtower there. Oh, where are we making our medicine? Not the vocational training center. Distilleries, right? So we've got one making medicine. Just not enough by the looks of it. We've only got sixteen medicine, so maybe we need another. Uh oh. Full response. Maybe we need another distillery. What's it under? Tier 2, maybe? Distillery. Right, we're going to get one of you. And we'll stick you right there. We're going to get our road coming down this way. A building is on fire. We know. It's been fixed. Clear the debris. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Production. Uh, kitchen. Right, we built that. I don't know what that one was making either, but it's okay. Our food isn't too big of an issue anyway. We've still got 93 people sick, but hopefully when we get this done, we'll get more medicine going. And what else will we short of on this? Apples. So we need another orchid. So production. Orchid. I'm going to do two of these. Because we could do with more apples. I think we're doing okay for wood. So if we do these three as apples, that'll be fine. Alright, so our power is looking good. We're at 33,000. Do we have enough steel to do this yet? Oh, we're down to 22 again. We are going through some stuff. Oh, this one needs a specialist in. That's fine. That's going to produce our iron ore again. This is nearly out of... Um, Resources, which looks kind of bad. So I'm hoping that that replenishes at some point. So steel, we're only at nine. This, we, why are we not producing so much? Like right, that's only doing eight a day. That's only doing eight a day, and that one's only doing eight a day. So that's halved, and I don't understand why. Oh, it might be because of the illness and stuff, and our impatient rest leave. And we still got that going because we do need it right now. Uh, where's our little town centre? This one. Oh no, this isn't on. We need that on. Just to try and stop people dying. 92 people sick is really bad. Right, is our little infirmary built yet? I don't know where we were doing it. There. No, it's under construction though. Why are we slowed down? It's under construction. So hopefully we can get the infirmary done. And we can get our medicine done. And then hopefully we can get our apples up and running. Right, that's done. Apples, four of you, apples, and four of you. Right, so that should sort them out. This needs medicine. We get five of them, one of them. And we've got seven and five spare. That's okay. This has got no power. Why? Oh, we, why is our power just gone again? we got two diesel plants running to full capacity. That's making 9,000. And that's making, that's 18,000 power, right? But we are... Our consum consumption is 50,000. We might need another petrol refinery. Because we're only down to our crude oil is running low. Okay, so production. Petrol refinery. I go, where are we getting our oil from first? Where do we get our oil? Resources. Oil pump. Oh, okay, we've got... we got oil pumps getting all of these, right? Yeah, we do. So we should be producing plenty of oil. Just maybe not enough. I don't know whether there was actually any more oil about. It doesn't look like. 
So what oil we've got is what oil we've got. We've just kind of hoped that we can keep producing enough stuff to keep us going. But our power is back sorted again, that's good. Another group of travellers have come. We might lose a lot of people and we're short on wear clothes. So let's have a quick look on what our people are clothes are doing. So they're on regular on normal clothes. Their workwear is on regular and the specialists, they, yeah, they're all fine. So our kitchen is out. We're just going to do some mushrooms. We've got loads of them. Loads of them. We put three people in there and that is good. So it's just mostly steel that I'm mostly worried about at the minute. We've got another trader in. He's not giving us anything we want either. But things are coming together. We have fixed our conveyor belts for the first time after so much struggles and issues. Oh no, the building's been struck by lightning. Rebuild the kitchen. I like how you can rebuild them now as well, because you used to have to knock them down and re like, build them from scratch. But things are looking good and I'm happy with our progress. But everyone, thank you so much for watching. It really does mean a lot. Hope you are enjoying the series. If you're new to the channel, if you are enjoying it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed the episodes, hit the thumbs up, pop some comments down below, let us know what you think. I want to say a big thank you to all the people who signed up on the Patreon and joined as members. It really does mean a lot. Thank you so much for all the support. And we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.